I loved all of the evil side of the Doom mm-hmm. world. Yeah. When Austin Absolutely Butler right. shows up, even before that, all that said, I don't give a shit about those two. I don't so, care. The cell yes. here is the grandeur. And the production design. Production and the sound design. design is unbelievable. But the story I don't really care yeah, about a, at all. A, I can't believe that people are engaged with the good side and caring and rooting for the good side because there's none of that in here for me. Where it's like, yeah, got him. Yeah, I love this side and I hate that side. I don't have that. Aside from Javier Bardem and maybe Brolin, Zendaya and Rebecca Ferguson and Timothy Chalamet are not very charismatic in this movie. No, they're not. It felt like a Christopher Nolan movie in some ways. It does feel heartless and cold. Ultimately, for me to love this movie, though, I need to care about the good side. I don't really at all. This really shows my true colors, I guess, how little I care about Dune. I thought this was it. I didn't know that they're setting up for a third. The final line of the movie is like, the blood war has begun. I'm like, what? Again? That's a part three? I didn't. No, it's a spectacle. I just wish that it was a little more for me. I don't know if it's made for me. 